I was, you know, it, it, it moved me because uh, it, it's a story of a father and his son and, and his wife and a little family. We, we're pretending to be a big movie, but at the end of the day, it's just a father and his son and his wife in a little house in a very big situation, you know? Because I love it and uh, because I, I come from being a punk rocker growing up, so I it's all do it yourself. So I couldn't play other people's songs, so I wrote my own, and then you start telling your own stories, and uh, it's not all that different. It's just another way of telling a story. You know, you make the movie because you will love it, you know, and, and I love it, and, uh, and then you hope that people see it. And then when people see it and they're moved, that's uh, even better. <laughs> so it's a nice, nice situation. Well, you know, I had worked with Shia on my first movie, so I, I knew he's just great and just crazy enough for this role. And I, I, so I called him and I said, hey man, take a read, and if you like it, Let's do it. And uh, he said, OK, I'm in. And then I love Kate Mara and then uh, Gary Oldman. You know, usually you make a movie and you have the dream list, and then you have the real list, and then you have the real list, and then you I'm a fan of, 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 of movies and a fan of acting. And I don't put marks on the ground. If you want to leave, I have a microphone on you, so I hear you. You know, like this, I walk away. I still hear you. Uh, and you try to, I try to keep it honest, as honest as possible. In a story like this, it's about being truthful. Uh, because it's such a touchy subject, so uh, it's about being honest. I think it's about a, a father who, even through the horrible situation he's in and the world and everything, he still can see one thing and his son, which is something to hold on to, you know. Uh, no matter what, there's still one person left that you could, uh, you could hold on to. It's, it's a big deal, of course, you know. Like I said, you make a movie in a little room you're editing in a dark room and you just have dreams that someone might see it and then you come to a place and there's a lot of people. Really cool. <laughs> so it's really nice. Yeah.